Hey guys, what's up and welcome back to Two Toe Tags Metal Reviews and today we're going to react to the new music video from Alien Weaponry. Apologize by pronunciation. This is for the song Ihenga? I, I don't know. Either way, it's from their recent album Tango Roa which came out a few years ago. You weren't a fan of it. Uh, I thought there was some good stuff on it. It, it. The band, you can commend the fact that they tried something else because it doesn't sound anything like Two. Two. Which is we thought on, two was awesome. Yeah, that's on the two toe tags list for yeah. a reason. Like that album is sick. Yeah. Um, it's interesting, you know, a two year old album, and they're dropping a video for it, and maybe they're maybe maybe they're just trying to say like, hey, we're still around, we're working on something, or like I don't know. I'm pretty sure we reacted to something recently that was the same situation, wasn't it? Like, oh, Whitechapel. Yeah, it was Whitechapel. We did Whitechapel. They dropped the video from Kin, which came out like a year or two ago. Like. Eh, I don't know, maybe people are bored and they're just like, eh, we got nothing to put out. Or maybe maybe it's the label. Maybe the label's like, hey guys, you got another music video on there, and if you're not, you don't got something ready right now, like, just do an old song. And they're like, eh, yeah, yeah, fine. Who knows? Either way, I have no idea what this song sounds like. We've heard the album before, but it's, it's been a while. Yeah. So this is gonna feel new. It's gonna it's sound gonna... like a new song to us. <laughs> and as usual, we're hoping the video is cool. So, let's check it out. I mean, you know what? I dig this group. I, I like it's this good. song. Sounds good. This is what I'm saying with like this album had some good stuff. This is, this is the good stuff.
lot of this song reminds me of something you hear Gojira do. I agree with that. I dig it, man. Yeah. I, I, that, that was really good. And like I said, it's just, this album had some good stuff, and this is what I'm talking about. There was good stuff there. Yeah, I think visually, this album, that video was really cool, too. Was. Lots of um, really cool animations there. I think this is a good example of uh, something just kind of standing outside of the norm. Like, this didn't feel like a typical song by any means. No, it had like this super duper long, I guess, intro. They kind of just go through the form a few times before vocals started. When they do, it's this chanting, you got this whole like, you know, crowd. Like crowd, yeah, group vocal kind of thing going. And I thought that was pretty interesting, too. Like, I mean, obviously it's a song, but it just it kind of deviates from standard song structure. I thought that was really cool. I really My favorite part about this instrumentally was the use of cymbals and the, yeah. the placement of the cymbal shots and all those kinds of things. I thought that was really good. But yeah, you mentioned Gojira. I can't agree with that more. This definitely has Gojira vibes all over it. Uh, definitely groovy. Really cool stuff. It makes me want to kind of go back and listen to Tangaroa another time and uh, see maybe if I can appreciate it a little bit more than I did back when we listened to it two years ago. But um, I, I don't recall this song at all. This felt like a fresh new song, like I said at the beginning. Mm -hmm. But either way, I thought that was pretty good. I didn't enjoy that for what it was. I... Uh, I mean, I'm not going to lie, I wish there was more singing involved, there was, there was more, like, lyrics and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. um, the whole thing sounded like it was all in Maori, the, the yeah. words, I didn't, I couldn't make out any English words at all, and that's cool too, I actually like that, I like hearing songs that are in different language, I don't really care too much about um, lyrics and finding different lyrics, it's just an observation. But uh, yeah, overall pretty good, I like the video, I like the color palette of the video too, black, white, yeah. red, you can't go wrong. Cool. you can't go wrong with that. Um, so... As usual, I wish I knew what was going on. I'm pretty yeah. sure like there's a theme, there's a message behind it. These guys tend to be very cultural. They tend to be very environmental. Uh, yeah, very, the, very deep rooted in the Maori culture with what they present with their music. Exactly. So I, I would imagine lyrically and thematically, uh, it has a lot to do with that kind of stuff. It's all cool. Um, so yeah, pretty good stuff from Alien Weaponry. I would look. I'm looking forward to new stuff. Yep. I would prefer if this was a new song, something to get me hyped for a potential new album. And you know what? That would be exciting, exciting to see. If this was a brand new song, I would be excited. I'd say yeah. like, whoa, like where are they going? Yeah. Um, but I am still excited for whatever new stuff is coming from this band because these guys are cool. The first album was amazing. The second album had some good stuff too. And that's all we got for you guys today. So remember to like this video if you liked it. Tell us in the comments below, how do we pronounce the name of this song? I probably butchered it in the beginning and I apologize for that, but... Ihenga, Ihenga. We love to hear uh, what you guys have to say. <laughs> anyway, subscribe if you guys are new to the channel. I'm TV Fish. I'm by myself. We'll see you guys later.